have knocked before entering my room. Really? I should knock before entering your room, my own house. <laughs> Seriously. <sighs> mm, so why don't you just lose the towel? Let me see everything. I I I don't understand what you're saying. It simply means I want to see you nude. Come on. In fact, if you do that, I'll throw in a hundred thousand naira for you. You you mean I I, I should sell my pride for a hundred thousand? Yeah. Oh sorry, I can't. Down my room. Down. It's okay, it's okay. I'm leaving. When you're done, meet me down. Yes, get out. Use the door, get out!
Where are you going to, Lisa? And where is your husband? He, he went out. Without his phone. My husband left the house without his phone. So if I didn't come back to this house, you'd have actually left without informing me yeah. in my own house. I'm sorry, sis. I, I'm sorry, but I really need to go now. No, no, no. You sit down here and wait for my husband to come back. Do you think he drops you out of your room? No, I'm not. Sis! to rape me when everything judged for his appearance. Moreover, what is unseen counts for nothing. My attention appeared larger, more colorful, more mysterious than the bland and the timid masses. Can I ask you a question? Can you die for another person's mystery? I only kicked him, trying to defend myself. But I observed that he has an epilepsy. That was what happened between me and your husband. So, all these things has been happening under my roof. And I never knew. Problem. It's okay. Alice, I'm so grateful for what you and your husband has done for me these past years. Have been under your roof. Oh, I think I need to leave now. Thank you. Ah. 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 
please don't go. Ah! Have a happy married life. Please don't go. Ah! Ah! <laughs> God. God, blind me. Blind me. Blind me. Do not blind me. Blind me in my own house under my roof. Blind me. <laughs> Go to my friend's hostel that evening by 6 p.m. It was already getting late. My friend told me she is going to her friend's birthday party, that I should dress up and go with her. On getting there, she told me to wait, that she needs to pick up a friend. As I was waiting, Build what happened. <coughs> he raped me. She has just changed. She has become very rude. Disobedient, very stubborn and antagonizing. I don't just understand that girl again. Ah. Hmm. Have you tried asking her what the problem is? My dear, I've done that. She wouldn't talk. Where is she? I think she should be in her room.
Leave me alone. Let me be just go. Go. Let me open the door. It's me, Becky. Of baking for her to bring me to your house to ask for forgiveness, please. Forgive me. Why I'm sorry to for my life? <laughs> and I'm sorry can do many things. I'm sorry can soothe the pain. I'm sorry can heal a broken heart more than you can imagine. And there is no gain in proving your point in this already confusing and escalating situation. But I'm sorry you can clear the airways. And I'm sorry spreads through the heart. It permeates like kerosene. I'm sorry speaks of love. I'm sorry speaks of peace, understanding, care and forgiveness. I'm really sorry. This is really amazing your heart to forgive me. Everything that happened on that day was under the influence of alcohol. I didn't do anything in my right senses. Please forgive me. Forgive me. It's okay. I am guilty. I know the consequences of the crime I committed. And I am ready to face it. Because I know that I will still die.
my son. Crime will not solve this situation. Ustaz, we need not be carried away by love and do the things we never wanted to do. We shouldn't have come this far. As men, we are supposed to think of yesterday, today, and tomorrow before we act. Not to act straight, not to think straight. My word now is what becomes of your fate. 